arkadaşlar Meybe Van'da ekranlarına hoş geldiniz. Ben Yunus Emre. Bugün Mafya 1 serimizin 8. bölümüyle devam edeceğiz. Daha önceki bölümümüzde Luigi'nin kuzunu kurtarmıştık sokak serserilerinden. Şimdi onların kafalarını gözlerini kırmaya gidiyoruz. Hadi iyi seyirler. We'll talk later. kafalarını gözlerine ezeceğiz. Tabi önden reisler gidiyor, arkadan çömezler. Sürekli semazan gibi dönüp durmak şu içeriye. Hah. Lan Polat'la çakar gibi durduk aynı ha. Arkadaş konuşsana. Salute boys. So, what would be today? We gotta give a few clowns a good beating, Vinny. The best bet would be these superb bats. This one here is autographed by one of the MVPs of the league. Wow, I can't believe it. Is this really his? Well... To tell you the truth, it ain't. But if you're smashing someone in the face with it, they certainly won't question you. We'll need some heaters too. You never know. My words exactly. I've got these Colt 1911s. Great automatics. Thanks, Vinny. Sandal mı lan bunlarda? Hangi sapıda ha? Sopayı çekmiş bu adam. Ben şu arabayı çalıştırayım da gidelim. Bunu banka müdüründen çarptıydık ha. Dur basalım. Bunu bunu bunu. Kemik kırmaya gidiyoruz. Kemik. saatim var lan her saat polis olur aha şu mahallesine göz açılmış önceden burası kapalıydı polis ya geri git bana bu arada bir kere var Kimi bulacağız şimdi? Bif. Bifte kesin şu zaten. Ana adam araba çarptı. Bir sor bak Naci. Babayit babayit önden gidiyorsun gene işleri bize yapıyor biz soracağız ya konuştan Howdy partners How's tricks Hey there you fat bastard We need a little piece of information What's going on Adam o tarafa o tarafa ayrı ayrı oynuyor ha The gang of jokers have set themselves up in our territory And they're giving people a bad time They mess with Luigi's daughter And if it wasn't for Tom here Who knows what they would have done to her We need to know where they meet, so we can deliver them a message from Don Salieri. Came to the right place, Pauly. I know what's going on. A few people have already had problems with them, and they told me... me...
meet at the old service station near the Terranova Bridge. It's a little ways from here. You can get there through a sort of side door across the yard. Send them my regards, Paul. Thanks, Biff. I owe you one. We gotta go. Take it easy, boys. Servis istasyonlar şu yolun aşağısında da değil. Nereden geliş var ya? Ben dur. Oyun yavaş yavaş ısın arkadaşlar. Şey önceden git, pat pat, çutlat, taramalı şimdi çatışmalara falan. Yani esas mafya olayına gireceğiz. Bakayım. Sopayı elimize çekecek mi? Tamam, ateş etmeyiz. Kapıyı sen mi kırıyorsun, ben mi kırayım? Ben kırarım. Ya Allah! Bana da kimse yok. Gel gözüm, gel. Gel, gel. Can falan yok gel bana gel. Somebody stopped in for a tuning. Bas hem nereye gidiyor?
What are you trying to pull here? I'm trying to kick your ass out of this part of town. These guys are mafia, Johnny. Let's hit the road. Oh, shit. Quick, get to the car. We gotta get him. Go and nail him! You can't feel sorry for these animals. He'd shoot you in the back the first opportunity he gets. 
I thought about what my mother or Sarah would do if they saw me there. Well, this one's finished. One less to worry about. Why are you standing there with that look on your face? Remember? Those guys wanted to do your girl yesterday. You better get used to it. I got used to it. Fahishe. Your last mission didn't exactly work out, Tom. Your killing everybody means a lot of problems for us. They tried to rape Sarah. The cops ought to thank me. I know, but the one you let get away will make trouble. What? We didn't let anybody get away. They're all dead. One lived. They pulled him out of the car wreck. Shit. The one you killed was the son of a city councilor, the mayor's friend, and Morello's accomplice. And the one who lived will go crying to the counselor. Daddy didn't exactly love his son. But in these cases, a person can remember a lot of good things. By the way, his funeral's today. Pity I can't make it. You're lucky that second one didn't know who you were. And couldn't give you up. But that's not why I sent for you. Tom, I have quite a delicate job for you today. Come on, let's get in the car. One of the businesses which the Don has invested a lot of money in has suddenly decided to forget his obligation. And he has taken up with Mr. Morello. It seems that Morello is trying to test our limits. We're not going to play his game. So what's going down? We're going to blow the place up. What? What kind of joint is it? A hotel. Yeah. That is, it's a brothel, Tom. But no regular who house. It's a place for classy society types. And I have to knock them all off? Of course not. We'll just liquidate the owner and blow up his office. That should be enough of a warning for the others. We means me, right Frank? I take out the owner and I blow up the hotel. Exactly. And there's one more thing. One of their girls is passing information about our activities to Morello. We'll need her eliminated, too. Frank... I, I have to kill a woman? Worst luck, huh? Here's a photo of her. She's cute. And she looks familiar. Are you certain this is her? Unfortunately, yes. Our big mouth has lost us a pile of money and some of our people. Why don't Polly or Sam do it? We know the place in and out. They'd be dead before they can get it together. Mm, uh, so what's the plan? It's downtown, the Corleone Hotel. Find the boss and shoot him. You can do it in public. It'll be a warning. Then take care of the girl. The owner's office is on the top floor. Grab any documents and money you find there and then set up the explosives. You won't have time for much else. This won't be no picnic. I know. But if we don't take care of this now, we are next in line. Maybe you're right. The weapon and explosives are here in the car. Tom, good luck. Arkadaşlar 8. bölüm sonuna geldik. Kanalıma abone olup beğenmeyi unutmayın. Kendinize iyi bakın. Görüşmek üzere.